guess what I'm finally reviewing today? Literally the worst thing I have read all year. And that says a lot because I've read a lot of boring stuff. Age of Gaia. I finally got around to it. Yeah, I know. How bad could this be? Um, let's just say it was the worst. Oh my god. It was uh, 50 Shades of Grey meets... An ecological magazine meets Greek mythology. Uh, I spurred down Grit American Gods meets Fifty Shades of Grey. Uh, so I didn't like it, didn't care for it. Uh, a billionaire oil tycoon falls in love with a reporter. The book said she was a Robin, Rubenesque reporter. But this guy likes to eat skinny supermodels, so I was like, wow, this guy was weirdly attracted to someone who's not his type. And then you start to, and then in the story it says her eyes go from greenish to blue, kind of like the planet Earth. So you know from the beginning of the story, you pretty much figure out that this is the Earth goddess Gaia. Um, the parts with BDSM in it were kind of weird because every time he would, I don't know how to, what the word would be, release the frustration with her, domestic, I don't know how to explain it, violence uh, against her in his basement dungeon something horrible would happen to his corporation um a mine would collapse a tanker would over over get destroyed off of some rocks so every time he inflicted violence on this woman the earth it's because she was the earth goddess the earth itself would rebel against his company um this is literally the only thing by love grove i have ever not liked it was just completely out there as far as what I read. Um, I love God Punk and it was supposed to be God Punk, but this did not seem much for me. And there's the cover in black and white. Um, so this is a third story in the book. It was disgusting. I hated it. I did not like it. I think I gave it one or two stars on Goodreads. That's how bad it is. Um, I know writers usually keep to their same genre. I wish he would have. I just don't like a lot of Voyeurism in books, I guess would be the best word. I don't want to, in my head, see other people doing that. It's kind of gross. Um, definitely the first sto two stories, The Age of Anansi and The Age of Satan, were significantly better than this, but these weren't the best ones I've read by him. Um, Age of Zeus was good. Age of Odin was good. Age of Aztec was good. And I've actually got Age of Ra over there and Age of Voodoo. So those are two books I'm actually looking forward to reading. Um, I did look forward to this, and then I was hugely disappointed. Um, this is probably, I'd have to say, some of his worst work he's ever done. But it's still worth, I guess, checking out. So there's the cover of this one. Um, there's the three stories that are on it. Whom the Gods Would Destroy. It says, Porno Keitsch, uh, there's one of the people that reviewed it, said, Love Grove is vigorously carving out a god punk subgenre. Rebellious underdog humans battling an outmoded belief system. Guns help a bit, but the real weapon is free will. Here's that. I got this from Thrift Books for like $3 and something. So it was not very much. So uh, thank you for watching. If you think it was, if you, have you ever read Age of Gaia or have you read anything by James Love Grove? Um, comment below and let me know what you think. Uh, thanks for watching.